the Mendocino Complex fire became the second largest wildfire in California's history Monday. It has already burned hundreds of thousands of acres and crews are struggling to contain it. The Mendocino Complex fire is just one of at least 16 large wildfires burning across the state. Nearly 14,000 firefighters are on the front lines. John Blackstone has more. Parts of the Mendocino Complex fire are proving to be unstoppable. Firefighters in Lake and Mendocino counties ignited more backburns overnight to remove tinder dry brush, fueling this massive wildfire. But fierce hot winds continue to whip flames into a frenzy. More than 400 square miles have been scorched, making this California's second largest fire on record. A CAL FIRE spokesperson predicts it could become the largest fire in the state's history by tomorrow. It's been hotter and drier. Here, right? Yeah, the higher temperatures, we're going back up to the high 90s. It's making for some extreme fire behavior. The growing inferno sparked new evacuations. It's already destroyed 75 homes and threatens 9,300 structures. Farther north, near Redding, the so-called car fire has claimed a seventh life. Utility worker Jairus Ayeta died in a vehicular accident while he was trying to restore power in dangerous terrain. The fire is entering its third week with 163,000 acres burned and more than 1,000 homes lost. And as large swaths of California continue to burn, President Trump ignited a fiery debate over how to best fight these wildfires. In a tweet, the president criticized Governor Jerry Brown, saying he must allow the free flow of the vast amounts of water coming from the north to fight fires instead of it foolishly being diverted into the Pacific Ocean.